that is, I'm going to try to do a live battle with my mobile phone. And we'll see how that turns out. Hopefully, nobody's calling me, because that will actually screw things up. Uh, and we don't want that to happen, do we? Other than that, um, what can I say here? I should probably try to show you my team, right? I hope so, I hope so. Alright, that is obviously not going to work. Uh, never mind, actually, I'll try to go through it once I... <laughs> we get through this menu. Uh, and yeah, other than that, I have turned off the um, volume of the game because I do think uh, most of you guys will appreciate uh, having a theme instead of this. So, yeah, look at that team. Let's see Lapras, Kangaskhan, Go Goat. Oh man, no. Oh, oh, Go Goat. Oh. Why? Why would you do that? I mean, a Rotom is fine. It could be Specs, or it could be, you know, probably Obvious, which could be Scoffed, actually. And Vivillion, which is, you know, the Hurricane set. It's gonna really, really halt the game a lot there. And Primate, which probably is a Scoffer, though I have seen, like, the Life Orb set, so... <laughs> I'm not too familiar here. I, myself, could do something like this, I think. He's using this team, so, yeah. It's almost the same as I usually use. The only new guy there is uh, obviously Jairus, who is a uh, Taurus. Um, nothing really special to say about him at the moment. And other than that, who should I start with? He would probably think I'm going to start off with Clover to set up rocks. So I should predict him for that and actually think Phoenix can do well here. You know what? I actually think my Gyros or my Taurus could start a really good thing here. So I'm going to lead with him and hope for the best. Uh, like I said, I do think he will start with Vivillion. <sighs> I hope I'm right because this team has been losing so much that it's not even worth mentioning. I have two wins and eight losses at the moment. So <laughs> yay me, right? <laughs> Should probably reconsider this team for something else. Though every time it lost, it lost like... Like barely, like it was one to two uh, post left. So it's not really that bad, but it has trouble. It has some really, really high trouble here. So, Kangaskhan. Yay! I don't know what this thing does. Uh, I really don't know what this thing does. Should I know what this thing does? I don't know what it does. It could go for... Probably a fighting move, consider like... Like I said there that I had Clover that was weak to it. Um, <laughs> oh, I have to 3000 eggs, finally. It took some time to get through that. Uh, <laughs> no, we switch here. Um, the only thing that I think can deal with this rather properly, and that is, uh, that is actually Phoenix and Resod, if there is a special set, which it isn't, uh, and it can't do anything against my Akinortic, which is my uh, Mushana, I think it's called. I call it Muna for too many times, but it's Mushana. So yeah, I'm gonna hope for best here and fake out. All right, you know what? I can deal with that. I probably recover more than I lose. Let's see. Life or alright. Hmm. So you could go for a return bet. worst case scenario, I guess. I myself am just going to try to do some damage because it's too early to set up. He has too many counters for me to even like count. But I do fear the Vivillion coming in here. Oh, power punch. Oh, okay, that won't do too much. Though it could try to build for a Sucker Punch, uh, which I actually get. It can most definitely hurt me, and I should keep that in mind, actually, because now I think I am in range where I could kill him. Uh, I do feel that he will actually see that coming and go for a Sucker Punch here. I don't think he is too ballsy here. Um, oh, that was not... 
good way to go. Alright, so I'm just going to go for Coal Mine. Like I said, hope that he actually goes for... That he goes for... Sucker Punch. Yeah. Oof. Nice call. So it really doesn't matter, though. I mean, I get more HP, sure, but I'm still in the range where Sucker Punch will hurt me no matter but, but what. <laughs> but what? <laughs> Never mind. So, like I said there... I should try to take him out anyway, but I know, like I said, that Sucker Punch will hurt because he's boosted one time. And I'm not going to like try to stall him out for it because, yeah, the obvious thing is that it's just going to be a really, really boring game. And, wow, alright. That sucks. That really sucks. Wow, that hurt. That really hurt too much, and I go in to pay up dearly for that. Uh, but I couldn't really go around it either. I could probably have gone for my, you know, try to uh, outwall him there with uh, my Phoenix. But I also knew that I was in no good position to actually try to stall him out it. So here's the Biblion, and I do know what these guys does. Uh, the thing is, though, would he go for a Bug Bus trying to take him out directly? Or would he try to set up with Quiver Dance? He couldn't go wrong either way, actually. I'm always in no position to keeping this one around. I have a coal mine backed up, but I don't think it will help much, actually. So he probably sashed. I will pr probably go in front. Oh, sleep hard. Oh. Fours. Wow, this. This can turn out ugly, actually. Should probably have thought about that. Should really have thought about that. Wow. Well, the thing is, though, what can I do from this position? Uh, yeah, what can I do? Oh, I think I outsmarted me. Hmm. So these guys usually have hurricane. I really think I need to stay in here. I need to do a hit off here, and obviously gonna set up um, either way that quiver dance here. Yeah. So I hope I wake up. I mean, that's the only thing I can hope for. Because a bugless will take me out never mind actually or nevertheless. Come on! Pull through! Yes! So yeah, fuck you. Um so at least now I'm in the range where a mock punch will help me out. Well not really. Wow, it actually took it somewhat well. And consider that it is four times resisted. Oh come on, I think my Phoenix would pull through. So yeah, we'll probably go for bug bus. Why? Why? Why do you persist? <laughs> oh, dear God, alright. So I'd like to try to keep setting up. I don't think this guy has... Uh, he could have the Draining Kiss. Uh, but I'm starting to get in a position where I actually can survive a hit from him. Uh, so I think we'll try to go for another Quiver Dance, just try to set up. Most likely. I think. So no battle tests yet, alright. Alright, there's the bug bus. Kinda weird, I've probably gone for it directly myself, because I, like I said, I was not entirely sure it could have taken me out there. And, well, the thing is, since he got, um, since he got that boost, I am somewhat in a bad position, I need to risk it, and like I said, it is four times resisted, but then again, Vivian is rather frail. So I should be able to mock punch it to death here. He could see through that and switch out. He did not. Die, 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 crap. Like a hurricane. Alright, I am not in a good position anymore. That was a crit. I don't think that matter. Even with TV Light Boost, I don't think that matter. Oh man, that that really, really, really brings this game to somewhat of a halt here. Oh man, this sucks. 
that really, really, really sucks. Mm. Oh man, I'm gonna like somewhat upset here because I don't really know what to do. I have nothing that is faster. I can only like bring something that I know will die. Uh, wow, this Vivion really like doing some work here. I mean, Bug Bus is super effective, but I don't think it will take me out. Let's see what happens. There's the hurricane. Thank you. Thank you. I needed that. Because I actually lost my physical wall at this point, so... Yeah, I'm in trouble. I should have probably done this to begin with, but I thought, you know, I didn't want my cradle lead to get hurt, and it's gonna, it's gonna pay me dearly here in this game. So there's the primate, and I mean, it could probably go for close combat, and going to hurt is gonna hurt really well. And I have nothing on my team that can take it well at all. So I think my safest move here is to try to dent it a little bit. I know a close combat won't kill. But I'm still in some of the trouble here. Hopefully he goes for a U-turn. Alright, there's a close combat. Come on, Clover, survive this. Huh. Impressive. Alright. That sucks too. so much. Oh, I actually think I lost. Because I have so many pokes that are weak to fighting at this point. I only got Resod left that isn't. I don't think he can do too much though to this guy. Though I could hope, and I'm gonna say could hope, uh, he's gonna go for another close combat and then go for Brain Punch. Uh, just to recover as much as possible, really. Because I don't know if this guy is choice banded or not. So I don't think I'm gonna find that out, probably. Oh, man. Yeah, th this really sucks. It, it really does. That is banded. That is a banded motherfucker. Oh, shit. Well, GG. Like I said, there's really nothing I can do here. Oh, this team hasn't worked at all. And it really pulls through here, or it really comes to show here when I can't even dent a freaking primate. So it should die from the overheat because of the like range that it is in. You know, being now. Mean that his defenses are down two times but I don't think I can do much here I really don't you see here is the Lapras and it's gonna go for a surf and I can't stop that from happening but I can hurt it real well with a wild charge Though it is somewhat bulky, so I don't think that will actually do too much. Probably around the heart, best maybe. Ooh. Ooh, it did. I think it did well there. So, alright, life orb and everything's gonna rack up there. Never, ever get this poor pyro to work. <laughs> I mean, the comments I got on YouTube is like, uh, at least, like, it hurts really well, but yeah, it freaking dies too, so no. And it really, I, I mean, I needed my uh, Phoenix or my Girder to actually pull through in this game, so I actually screwed myself over a little, and I can't really do anything here. Though at least you guys get to see Gyros, which is a special set um, <laughs> Tauros, so it's kind of cool, but you know, it's too late in the game to actually do anything. 
So there's a bulldoze, which means that that's the physical dragon dance set. I like this guy you saw there. It is specially defensive, and I can't deal with it at all. So yeah, it really, really, really sucks. Uh, oh man, the girl loss is so gonna matter. Such a screw up from my side too. So yeah. Oh man, I, I oh, how could I screw up this badly? <laughs> oh man, man, man. But you know what? You just have to accept these games. I mean, at least I got to showcase a few of my folks there. Uh, and that's really, really all I can say. I mean, there's a Rotom, and it has to win just because it is a Rotom. Because I am a flamethrower, um, probably this thing is probably Scarfed or Specs, in worst case scenario. So I can't stop this from happening. I really can't. So he's gonna win with a 2 0, and like I said, there was really nothing I could do the second I decided to waste my girder. So, yeah. GG, best luck truck for this game. Um, yeah. Ah, crap. I, <laughs> I am actually a little real upset because I, I do know I could have displayed this well or much better if I just went for Clover to begin with. So, really, really, really sucks I decided to play like this. And, yeah. I mean,. Yeah, I can do anything. <laughs> so, alright, anyway, like I said, BZ Truck, thank you for this battle, and uh, I hope for rematch sometime with a new team. And for everybody who's watching, thank you for watching, as always, and well, bye.